Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. Uh, we got our bloom package. Hello, there we go. And uh, we should water this hot mess up here. Okay. Rather damp, cold mess. Now we've got one of the fish that we were wanting and uh, for our package, and we need to also get back out to the other zone soon. So I'm gonna go try to do a little bit of fishing, I think. And I think we need to get back out to Withergate. Um, you can see that we're like on the brink, <laughs> on the brink of uh, being able to level up here our, uh, um, sorry, my brain just died as I was trying to, I was like, oh, I can get over there and get those things. Um, yeah, we're on the brink of, uh, the 100,000, so we've got like 2,000 more, which we really don't have to sell too much here. Okay, and we got another flame fish. So that's interesting, so they appear here as well. Uh, okay, level fishing. So we've increased our spawning rate, uh, you know, a lot. Catching a fish increases your movement. Eh. Uh, eating a fish grants well fish buff. Eh, increasing mana regeneration and movement speed for five minutes. That's kind of nice. Uh, large net fish catch fish in two days instead of three. That's handy. Uh, bonus small fish. So all these fish net ones are, are quite nice, but uh, you know, at this point, I don't know if I need them as much. Increase the sell price of fish. Yeah. Grant a chance of playing treasure chest when uh, catching fish with a fishing rod, so you can't use the bubble. <laughs> First catch ki ki uh, fish grants gold equal to its sell value. Catching any fish restores mana. Okay, there we go. That's the one we want. Mana restoration. So we got like three flame fish now. So it is maybe possible that we can find the rare fish here as well. Um, I wasn't sure if we'd be able to do that, so that's good. So let's put these here, get our food down below. And then we'll uh, get on with catching fish. What is that? <laughs> what is that purple thing? I think it was, oh, Velveteen Beta. Yeah, I don't know that I've seen that. <laughs> this game is filled with tons of, I have no idea if I've ever encountered one of those. So what do we got? A unicorn fish and a uh, whatever that thing was. Horse fish. Yes. Yes, yes. Okay, well, I'm waiting for those to spawn back in. Let's go over here. At least the other place. Oh, I can't get at it because the snake could really. <laughs> whatever, dude. I'm not even going to see what you want. I'm not humoring you and your hostage taking here. Oh, my goodness. Okay, there's a legend way down there. Vacuum with the bubble. Come to me. Dragon Gulper. I feel like their spawn rate is super low right now. I could just be doing this manually. Okay, we got a couple. We got a frog prince and got another thing. Okay, I guess I'll do a few manually as well. Princely frog. That's what that is. I got a parrot. Thank goodness, I guess it's not a naked parrot. That's the idea. Another flame fish. What? Oh, do I not have room? No, I have room. Why couldn't I get that? Oh, that's curious, because it was on the edge of the net, catching it. So my net was like, absolutely not. Yeah, it is funny though. I do feel like this is going to be this, a thing that's just going to take a while to get. Um, but interesting, like if I do this, I won't need the Nelvari dollars, even though I'm like at 3,200 out of 5,000. And that was, that was going along better than I was thinking it would. <laughs> so it's, you know, hard to say. Velveteen Beta, Horsefish, what do we got over here? No, nothing. I, that, that was for. Oh, what is that? That's one of those ones I. a Neapolitan that I needed another one of those. That's good. Yeah, Neapolitan and a frilled beta. Very good. We're getting extra dollars, I guess, while we do this. 
So I am seeing, you know, the odd weird fish here. I don't know if this is going to be the spot for finding that fish. Another Neapolitan. It's weird. You go a long time without seeing a fish and then suddenly you just get a bunch of them. Dragon Gulper. It's still only 10 a.m. So we'll see. I don't know how we want to do this. Okay, put our bubble in there. Oh, that's a princely frog. Boo, go away. Nobody likes you, princely frog. Hey, fish, don't go downstream. I got some free right here. It's another frilled beta. Come here, fish. Yeah, I mean, other than there's the odd one that is super hard to catch, but at least they are generally speaking. Oh, whoops, <laughs> a little bit easier. Let me just waste my mana uh, sending a rain cloud over that fish. Real beta. Again, the fact that I, I continually do see fish, though, that I haven't caught yet does encourage me that maybe... Um, I mean, we fished a lot here and I never saw... Oh, you got to be kidding me. I missed that. <laughs> this is literally like a trash fish. Though green, the bar was green for 99% of the thing and I... Okay, two horsefish. Nice. Okay, let's get whatever this is. Oh, oh come on. <laughs> too, I'm just too hurried. Okay, unicorn fish. Yeah, that's funny that this fish will not come up into my inventory even if I get as close as possible. Huh. Weird. The danger zone. Okay. And... Whoa, whatever this is. That was a wicked fish. That is a angel fin. Okay, uh, yeah, those, those aren't the easiest to get, are they? Um... We'll just consume these unicorn fish, clear out some inventory space as well. I'll do that with maybe a few of these. Because uh, its sell price is not, it's just in orbs, and I don't need orbs. So. And it does give me a bunch of mana, so I may as well. Uh, Okay, got another parrot fin. Another parrot fin. <laughs> so I'll just keep eating the things I'm catching, I guess. Essentially, they'll start paying for themselves. Kind of distressing. This area doesn't seem as lively as the other area did. So maybe I will head over to the other area. Although, I, again, it does feel like a little of a wait for it, you know, like it might uh, come into play later than sooner. This actually is quite good if I just eat everything I'm catching. I'm just gonna be careful I don't get into a habit of like eating things that are like important. <laughs> so it's 150. Yeah, we'll head down. Maybe we'll head over to the west here. Let's go see what's over here. Because there might be... Yeah, there should be some stuff here, shouldn't there? Okay, let's see here. Maybe there'll be some things here. You never know. Okay. So yeah, this is a decent spawn rate too, isn't it? Look at that. Uh, Barkfish. So this could be good, this could be good.
Yeah, there's more popping in here than there was in other zones. Um, like they're they're appearing a lot quicker than previous. So there's a couple. Oh, what? That one just refused. There we go. Now it's on the move. It's a flame fish. That fish is just trapped over there now. <laughs> like how did that happen? Oops. Um, okay. Yeah, I don't know how that fish decides that it's just going to get stuck on the other side. Okay, there's multiple. Yeah, why well, want to grab that one? <laughs> Got an axolotl. Feel like that tasted endangered. Frilled beta. Okay. Uh, I feel like I should also, like, just destroy these rocks so that they're out of my way. <laughs> Oh, they, they're mean, these rocks. Okay, well, there we go, we'll do that, and then... Oh, look at that, we got a paired fish, and uh, it's gonna restore a little bit of mana for us. Oh my gosh, these rocks are horrible. <laughs> I just want the front two here done a little bit, that'd be nice. Oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. And we'll eat the parrotfish. Two axolotls, that's good. Let's get our skill points here. Uh, fishing. So, um, cast range of rods. I guess we could do that, sure. And then uh, exploding stuff. Oh, that reset the rocks, are you kidding me? Okay. <laughs> That was brutal. Well, while I'm waiting, I'll just smash this. Five o'clock. The spawn rate out here is really good. So, I mean, this is promising. So, that would be nice. Again, you know, having no stamina bar is, is a thing that I gotta say is an improvement in these games, as unrealistic as it is. And that does make you question, like, why is there any health bars? Also, there we go. I was like, why is there also no fish spawning in? Why is there so many caught over in the trees? Like, I had the room. That's kind of weird, right? Real betas. Okay, let's do this. Let's go. Hey, let's eat these six. Three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, and then uh, smash them. <laughs> I wonder what these uh, probably don't even sell for very much. Do you get a lot of XP for these for mining? Thirty-two. Yeah. Elven Heavy Stone. Let's see what that gives us. A 16. <laughs> Boo. Okay, so let's go, uh, let's do some manual fishing here. Ooh. Come here, fishy. Ooh, that was almost perfect. Okay, we caught an axolotl. Let's move this Elven Heavy Stone out of the way here. Um, there we go, Horsefish. We'll eat those up. And then uh, let's do some magical fishing again. So yeah, I don't know why any of these fish get caught up uh, in the sidelines there. That's kind of weird. Uh, I don't know about the Black Bass. Ew. Okay, horsefish. I 
7 p.m. So I don't know. I, I, yeah, it's interesting. I don't feel like there was more I should be watching. Might have been more down there. I don't know. Nope. Again, I think it's just going to be a, you know, a matter of uh, trial and error here of just continuing snobfish, barkfish, horsefish. Just eat that horsefish. Okay, there's another uh, mythical, legendary, whatever. It's a koi. Royal koi. Do any of these have a sell price or is it... No, nah, it gives me eight. Give me some orbs. Thankfully, I don't need orbs. April beta. Wow. So, yeah, I thought, you know what, I thought maybe a full day of fishing here we might find it, but it is more elusive than that. Again, or it's out of season. I, I just suspect it's not. Um, again, given the, the variability we've seen here in the fishing days, it just seems kind of random. We've run into, like, like there we go, there's six flame fish, and I hadn't seen a single one before that. So, who knows? It just does seem really chaotic. I, I don't know. I think what I do need to get do get doing is get out to um, Withergate next time and make sure I've like water crops up out there. I don't know if that I'm hoping that thing can grow in in time and maybe you know we might be working on our tickets as well as this because if this is out of season or whatever this will just take forever. So I don't know. I'm a little yeah I'm mystified on this one. I we're so close. I, that's what's getting me. <laughs> it's like, we're so, so close. Okay, well, we have lots of stuff, but nothing I really want. Okay, there's another uh, bubble fish. Axolotl. Um... Oh, well, the bubblefish gave you quite a bit of uh, <laughs> XP, I think. Yeah, I like to see like when you throw one out and you're getting like four. Uh, Barkfish, Leaf, Soul, Axolotl, Frill, Beta. Okay, 9.30. Alright, I think we're going to wrap it and head it back. It's hard to do it. <laughs> I just want to keep fishing. So that, that spot's a potential one, though. I think it's a, a definite possibility. Um, again, that one spot we had was really good. But again, we might have just... Might have been because we hadn't fished there before was the reason why we are seeing all those great spawn-ins. It's really hard to say. It's a parrotfish. What is that? That is another Crystal Tetra. See, I haven't seen one of those in a while. <laughs> and yet that was one of the hard fish to get. So it is pretty random. I would have been thinking some of those were completely off season because you're just like, I haven't seen that in ages. Okay, Axolotl, Barkfish, uh, Kelpie Eel. I can't even remember. Uh, we, we know we've seen a crystal touch, but I don't know if I've handed one into the museum. I don't know. I think I need to go back and hand some of this stuff into the museum because I'm once again sort of forgetting. Uh, but I think maybe I will. Uh, well, we'll see what we're doing money-wise. I don't think I've handed enough stuff into that was worth anything. So we're probably going to be waiting. Uh, but we need to get up to Withergate. All right. We'll see you all next time. Till then. Bye bye.